Good morning, everyone. Another installment of Workout Wednesday. April Dupree here with fitness and nutrition expert and lazy man, Mackie Shilson, even though all of us know that Mackie is the furthest thing from lazy. <laughs> we are at the Best Off Sculpture Garden, and we actually have been here over the past couple of weeks showing you guys some amazing exercises. Today, you notice that we are uh, at a bench with Bernard. This is our friend Bernard. He is going to help us, as well as Mackie, show us. This is Gladys. <laughs> you have the and, attention and span. Mary. Of a I've been net. talking to Gladys, Gladys and Mary. Gladys and Mary. <laughs> He's going to show us an exercise. Or is that Mary and Gladys? Be quiet while I intro this exercise. He is going to show us an exercise uh, using the squats and using your hamstrings eccentrically. So I want you to explain the difference between concentric and eccentric in regards to fitness uh, for everyone, because I know those are terms that people may kind of not fully understand. Well, with Gladys and Mary, or is it Mary? Uh, okay, I got it right. Um, the idea <laughs> is this is called eccentric and that for the hamstring and that is how hamstring injuries occur okay it happens during the deceleration so eccentric means the hamstring is lengthening and we're going into shortening for instance what happens with this with a running back in the nfl getting behind the quarter first movement is down mm -hmm. that's exactly eccentric loading What's the first movement of the receiver? He takes the put, usually puts at standing at the line of scrimmage, the foot back down. All the sports movements, and in general, our movements, in many cases, a catcher, he is loading eccentrically. Yeah. So I am going to show you an exercise, one with a tube, and then one with a dumbbell where I'm going to ask April to help me to hand me the weight so we're going to be very safe. Okay. And so watch what I'm up. I'm going to use a chair. And if I use a chair at home, I'm going to back it up against the wall. Gotcha. It's very stable. Very so important. I'm going to be about one foot away from, from the ed edge of the bench. Okay. I'm going to take this little rubber band, very light, and, I'm, and I could use uh, uh, just a, a, a regular tube. Now, notice I'm slightly loading. I just loaded. I loaded eccentrically. I'm going to pull this up to a level that I, I'm comfortable with, maybe about chest high. Now, notice what I'm going to do. I've got the cord here. I'm going to sit down, take the tension off, stand up. I loaded eccentrically in the deceleration. Mm -hmm. Put the tension back up. Now, watch what I'm going to do. Slow down, offload, come back up. So I can go one, two three gotcha. and what will happen eventually you'll feel the fatigue in the hamstring 70 percent of your hamstring strains occur in the belly of the muscle and i can tell you that that this will work in the area of the bicep femoris you have the semimembranosa tendinosa the heads of the hamstring inserting up into the lower pelvic area mm. So the idea is I'm using a simple tube or I could just use a long tube. Now, can I borrow that dumbbell, Bernard? Oh, okay. Now, You're April, best. you come over here. Okay. Now notice what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna grab the weight. I'm gonna sit back down and load, uh -huh. hand it to April. Gotcha. I don't want any weight when I get up and then I can push off. Perfect. So I can down. A little song and dance. Down like that. Awesome. And I can push off. We're almost out of time. Okay. So how many reps of these should we do? Because uh, it seems simple, but obviously the more time well, we do it, it's going to become more challenging. I can tell you with the tubing, the idea is uh, maybe 10 to 15. Okay. In, in, in the type of work that I need, maybe we're going to do 20 to 30. Gotcha. And again, you don't need a heavy weight. I mean, these are two pound weights and that is a light tube. Gotcha. No, makes sense. Definitely work these out, guys. Hamstrings, we injure them a lot doing simple things in life. So thank you guys so much for joining us for another installment of Workout Wednesday. Please visit MaxwellNutrition.com and find some amazing fitness think, and wellness tips. And, of course, doing? we want you to visit like WWLTV.com you really and click on the health tab. Gladys, Mary, no, Bernard. No, it's Mary Gladys. Get your friend. Sorry, she doesn't I know. I got a good memory. Good enough. I remember.